Thanks for joining. This is Movado, and I'm back here with another Empyrea and Galactic video. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about how to repair your ships in Empyreon. This should work in all versions, whether it be vanilla Empyreon, Reforged Eden, or any of the other many, many scenarios that exist out there. Uh, it's a question I see a little bit come up, and you know, sometimes I think there's some uh, confusion or uncertainty around how the repair function works, what it does do, what it doesn't do. Um, so to get started, I'll show you how it all works, where you can find the repair bays. You can see here I've got a base spawn. This is called my orbital solar repair bay, and you can see I got a little repair bay right here in the middle. The other place that you'll find the repair bays are on CVs. I've got my Hyperion carrier here. You've got a repair bay there along with the repair console over there. The difference between the two, there is a difference. While they both will repair the ships, uh, the CVs will not repair another CV. So if you have a damaged CV, you must repair it on the base, uh, which is why I like to use a base for repairs. Although if you like to go with the mobile route, you're going to probably have to have repair bay on a CV or drop a base like this somewhere just to do your repairs. So that's what you find. You need a repair station like that or a repair, what is it called? A repair bay. And then you need the console up here. Okay, so what I did is I took my Soder SV, I shot this Soder SV, and you've got a bunch of damaged blocks, you've got missing blocks on it. So in order to repair it, there's always two things you, you want to do to it. Uh, but let me show you something before I get into that. I'm actually going to fly this ship over here really quick. Uh, one thing people get tripped up on or forget to do with new ships is save the template. So that ship I spawned, I didn't change a single block on it before I shot it, so the template already exists. The template of the ship gets created when the ship is spawned. Let's say on this ship I would have gone and I would have added a turret. I'm just going to grab one turret and I'm going to throw it on and say, hey, I added a turret to it. Now, this here's the key. Since I made the change to the ship, the template no longer knows that this turret is there. So if in battle that turret were to get destroyed and I repair this to template, that turret will not come back. I will have to manually replace it. Not a big deal for simple things, but some of the more expensive stuff you can, you can kind of forget or whatnot. Um, what you got to do is if you ever add a turret, add a block, add thrusters, any other device within the ship, you go into the ship's P menu, and I can't stress this enough, save the template. It tells you last save now. Save, save, save that template. It's also a good idea right before you go into battle, just in case you're not sure if you save the template. If you know you've got an undamaged ship while you're flying, just go into the P menu and save that template. Remember, this is going to be the key. If you don't click save that template, it's going to try to revert your ship to when you spawned it. That will not include any upgrades you put on that ship. Okay, now you can see I damaged this ship. So I'm just going to lower it a little bit. You don't want to dock it, because if it docks, it won't repair. But you just want to hover it right above that repair center. And now when you go into the repair console, there's two options. It's repair blocks and repair to template. So repair blocks does just that. It only repairs the damaged blocks. So uh, I probably could have loaded this up before, but I can do this really quick here. It's asking for 19 iron ingots, and I have zero in there, so I'm just going to take that stack, I'm going to throw it in there, and that's it. Um, I'm going to hit automatic mode, I hope this goes pretty quick. That means it's just going to automatically repair. And you can see, I kind of saw a couple of the blocks pop. Yep, and now all the blocks are repaired. There's not a single damaged block on this whole ship, but it's still missing a lot of blocks. That is because I did not repair to template. So the difference between repair blocks and repair to template, repair blocks just repairs the damage, repair to template replaces the missing blocks. Automatic mode, which is right here, means that if you park your ship over it, and let's say I leave it in repair blocks mode, if I park my ship over it, it'll automatically repair the blocks without me coming to the console. To repair to template, it is also asking for some titanium. So grab a stack of titanium, and I am going to drop that in. And now I've got 8,000. And see, now it says total repair time is a minute 12, time remaining a minute. So it is counting down. I don't have this set up to be instant. But in one minute's time, you will find 
that all those blocks are going to be re replaced on this and this ship will be brand new. Uh, biggest thing to remember, the biggest question I see is some people think repair the template re repairs the blocks. It doesn't. That just simply repairs the missing blocks, whereas this top one will fix blocks. All right, I'm going to pause the video really quick while this finishes and you'll kind of see what it does here. All right, I'm back. The repair just finished. We'll come up here and we can see all those blocks are now missing. All the blocks are repaired, all the repaired blocks are back, and we're done. And that is how you repair your ships. You can do SVs, HVs in the CV. It is exactly the same way. The menus work all the same way. But that's how you repair your ship again. Keep in mind, you always want to save your template anytime you do changes. Uh, one place you can get in trouble with templates is if the ship is already damaged. Let's say there's some damaged blocks or a couple blocks missing. Obviously, if you save the template with damaged blocks or missing blocks, those now become the norm and it won't replace those or fix those. So, All right, well, that's all I got for today. today. Thanks for joining. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, hope to see you next time. Hit that like and subscribe button and uh, take care, everyone. See you next time.